Welcome to Device Help Support. Your ultimate destination for everything related to device setup, troubleshooting, and optimizing your tech experiences. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos related to setup, troubleshooting, and unboxing. And don't forget to press the bell icon so you don't miss our latest videos. In today's video we will discuss how to set up TP-Link B3600 Dual Band Wi-Fi 7 Range Extender. The TP-Link B3600 Dual Band Wi-Fi 7 Range Extender is a next-gen device that expands your router's Wi-Fi coverage. It supports ultra-fast Wi-Fi 7 speeds. If you're looking for the best extender that gives you the perfect Wi-Fi range coverage, then this video is specially made up for you. So without wasting any time let's start the setup process. I hope in the end, this video will prove helpful for you. Firstly we will unbox the product. Inside the TP-Link B3600 Dual Band Wi-Fi 7 Range Extender Box, you'll find the extender unit itself, a quick installation guide to help with setup, and a power adapter, if required in your region. Everything is neatly packed so you can get started with extending your Wi-Fi coverage right away. Now insert the TP-Link B3600 into a wall power socket near your main Wi-Fi router. Wait about 40 to 60 seconds until the power LED on the extender turns solid, not blinking. This means it's ready for setup. Locate the WPS button on your router, it may be labeled WPS or WPS one mesh. Press the button for about one second. The WPS light on the router will start blinking, meaning it is now searching for devices to connect. This WPS pairing window stays open for about two minutes. Within those two minutes, go to your TP-Link B3600 and press the WPS RE button for one second. The extender's WPS status LED will start blinking, showing it is trying to pair with the router. After a short while, about 10 to 30 seconds, the extender's LED will turn solid. The signal slash link LED will light up. Once pairing is complete, unplug the extender and move it to a location halfway between your router and the weak signal area. Plug it into a wall socket there and wait until the LEDs stabilize. Now setup is complete. I hope this video will prove helpful for you. If you're stuck in middle of the process then don't worry. Contact our professional experts at 1-323-507-3713. They will solve your problem as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe devices help and support. And also stay tuned for the more updates.